Chapter 11 Story Time with Tommy It's entitled The Sexy Passenger Ooh la la Ooh la la A man boarded an airplane And took his seat Now as he settled in He glanced up and he saw the most Beautiful Beautiful women Ever seen on earth Boarding the plane he soon realized she was heading straight towards his seat. As fate would have it, she took the seat right beside his. True story. Eager to strike up a conversation, he blurted out, Business trip or pleasure? She turned, smiled, and said, Business. I'm going to the annual... Nymphomaniacs of America convention in Boston, in town. He swallowed hard. <laughs> he was the most gorgeous woman he had ever seen sitting next to him, right next to him. And she was going to a meeting of nymphomaniacs. Imagine, struggling to maintain that composure. He calmly asked, What's your business at this convention? Lecturer, she responded, I use the information that I have learned from my personal experiences to debunk some of the most popular myths about sexuality. Really, he said, and what kind of myths are there? Well, she explained, one popular myth is that African-American men are the most well-endowed of all men, when in fact it's the Native American Indian who is most likely to possess that trait. Another popular myth is that Frenchmen are the best lovers, when actually it's men of Mexican descent who who are the best? Who are the best? Not the French, men of Mexican descent. She said, I had also discovered that the lover with the absolutely best stamina is the southern redneck. Suddenly the woman said, you know, became a little bit uncomfortable and blushed. I'm sorry, she said. I shouldn't really be discussing all of this with you. I mean, I don't even know your name. Danto, the man said. Danto Gonzalez. But my friends call me Bubba. <laughs> Until next time. I love you all.